Hey, what's going on guys? It's Cliff with Pink Flamingo Power Wash. I'm back with a brand new video for you guys. Today we're working in Lutz, Florida. We're here for a house wash. We're gonna be doing a pool deck. Uh, we're, gonna, we're gonna be doing a lanai. And also we're gonna be doing a driveway and sidewalks and all that. Uh, this is a returning customer of mine. So I was here about maybe a year and a half or so ago. So he got me back out to do everything. So let's check it out. So this is a house we're doing here. A lot of plants in the front. So therefore we gotta be careful, wet down everything up top all throughout right there a lot of algae you know the gutters are pretty dirty the driveway here you know got that tree over the top it's not really as bad as i thought it would be got some spots right here but the driveway itself is not that bad i think this concrete is pretty old too so that's not algae down there over here we got a lot of algae though so like i said this property got a lot of plants you know you can see some algae marks right there on the wall this side right here the sun goes over it doesn't touch it so the algae grows grows pretty bad right right there this is the back area a lot of pavers uh a little standing under this part right here last time i did it has some standing water so the water gonna be standing right there but as far as the out, out here the pavers aren't really that bad i might just uh downstream and rinse it off maybe we're gonna do this little area over here do the pool for um, pool furniture and um partial fence cleaning which is not really that bad the, i did the whole fence last time the fence is pretty clean let me check out back there yeah it's not that bad back back there either so that's what happens when you do a good job this is the fence areas that's dirty up here a little green right there get that cleaned up before i start i'm gonna go ahead and start wetting down these plants right across over here by the uh, house because they, they get serious about their plants. You see all these plants? Putting our mix on now. Gonna hit this fence while I'm on this side.
so I spray down the patio in the inside there, the lanai. I spray down the floor, the pavers, and I did the back of the house. It's already coming off clean. Yeah, they're coming out nice. We're gonna, we should be able to start uh, rancing, but, oh, look at that. Melting like butter. So the back area is all done. Now we can proceed with the rest of the house wash. Waiting for that soap to come. There it goes. This gate. Always make sure you get this out of the gate right here, that, that corner. A lot of people forget the corner. One side spray down, you guys look, it's already coming clean. Same thing with that spot that I showed you guys when I first walked up. All that right there, look at that. It's just disappearing. I already wet down the plants in the front. So we're gonna uh, soap up the front and the uh, third side, the far side. Rinse that up and jump on this driveway. did all the soaping for the rest of the three sides of the house now we're just gonna rinse everything down that we uh soaked up nice and easy process not complicated at all man if you got the right equipment everything goes really smooth i mean i've been i've been here probably I got here like around 9.30. Let's see what time it is. 11 o'clock.
right guys we are done with the project this is the back end all cleaned up out here in the back pool deck wasn't that bad anyway to begin with clean that up my fences are nice and clean wasn't that many panels to do i didn't even charge them to do the fence because there's like two three panels side of the house is cleaned up no kind of algae man like he got a new paint job all the algae that was up there in the beginning is gone all my fascia and exterior gutters are clean job well done all right y'all gonna collect the check and then i'll head to the second job for the day so y'all i got like three three four in the schedule today so long day ahead all right guys we had the second job for the day right now we're in odessa florida we're here for a, a partial house wash i got this call from a yard sign it's crazy because this lady said she called three people in the midst of like 10 days nobody got back to her like they, people missed the call they didn't reply or nothing i can afford to do that so i didn't miss the call you know what i'm saying when she called I, I talked to her and she told me this so um what i'm here to do is a partial house wash three sides of the house uh nice and easy uh the drip hedge got a lot of algae on it a black algae oh that sun is beaming over here um let me get, get you guys over here in the shade you can see there's a lot of black algae on the drip edges because the roof is super dirty man this roof is bad um so when the algae comes off the roof it just rolls right into that fascia so that's why she wants to get that clean you can see a lot of algae over here on the vinyl up top look at the drip edges man they're really bad back here is not so bad but you can always see there's a lot of plants around i'm gonna water these down first before i start uh customer is actually at a funeral right now so um i'm gonna try and talk to her about getting the roof clean you can see that black algae right here on the edge it's all around the back area i didn't even get to see the other side yet i'm gonna start back here oh i can actually go through this gate thought i was gonna have to wrap around nice let's see nice big property too man look at that they got the pool cage like on the whole other side it's not a, like even behind their house yes sir uh back here is not so bad a little bit of algae on the um up top here on the vinyl but nothing crazy all right let's get our downstream on baby three sides soaked up let's go check out where we started from while that's dwelling over here on this side 
This would be a good roof to clean, man. Look how dark this roof is. Look at those streaks. That one, look, that's a garage over there. I think it's a garage, yeah. It's pretty clean. But this one is dirty. Probably gonna use the jet tip on these right here. On the, oh yeah. That whole thing gone right there. I'm gonna use the jet tip on the uh, fascia drip edge. Should come real clean. That algae on there black. Boy, look at that. Super black. All right. Should be ready to go, ready to rinse. Get this thing cleaned up. done with the house wash got the fascia cleaned up drip edges that big algae spot that was right there cleaned up do my quick walk around make sure everything is in order this house was built in 1959 it's crazy I mean the side over here would be done then we got another one more job on the schedule after this. All right, this side is good, good too. This side wasn't that bad anyway. All right, y'all, we at the final job for the day. Right now we're in Ruskin, Florida, which is about 45 minutes outside of my area. I'm not sure why I'm getting hits right out this way, man, because I don't really advertise for this area at all, really, man. So I guess my SEO is kicking in on this side of town. And uh, I've had a job out here in the last three weeks. This is my second time, I think, or two times in the last two weeks. But hey, I'll take it. <laughs> all right, so this is what we're doing here in the driveway cleaning with a little twist to it. Got some stains, oil stains that we're going to try to lighten up for him. You know, he know they won't be 100%. All things, I never guarantee that it will come up at all, really, man. I just tell him, you know, it'll look better. But once it's been baking in the concrete out here in the sun, like today is like 95 degrees out here right now. So, you know, imagine every day that thing getting baked on. <laughs> but um, we're going to make it look better. We're going to clean this up. Now you guys know before I clean, I mean before I do any kind of oil removal, I like to um, clean the surface first and then do the oil removal. So I just put the pre-treatment on there. I had to flush out my 12 volt anyway, so that's why I used the 12 volt. I could have just downstream this. So now I'm gonna surface clean it now. Um, all those white marks like right there, that's from tire shine. When they clean their cars, that's what those little moons are. So I'm gonna apply the degrease in these spots to try to uh, bring them back a little bit, man. Let's go. So that's been down there for about 10 minutes. Um, 
One thing is you gotta keep it wet when you're working in the heat because you don't want the, the greasy to dry up. So, um, you know, I, dry, I put a little bit on there at a the time, scrub it in real good, let it sit, come back, scrub it again a little bit, just like that. And um, yeah, man, we're gonna rinse it up and see what we get. done here and man I don't know man I like the results definitely look much better I didn't prom probably didn't promise no miracle but pretty much closest you're gonna get man it's closest you're gonna get right there I think the HOA can leave him alone leave him alone man leave him alone all right guys well we are done for the day did three projects everything came out great this customer was really happy he was surprised that it even came out that good um apparently that that that's only been there since thursday so when it's there like on a short period of time it's easier to get it up and it's been then the ones that have been there for like two years <laughs> those are so hard to get up but thursday so a couple of days ago, um, you know, it's not gonna make that much difference. Everything came out great. They did try to go themselves with some Dawn dish soap. Didn't work out for them. <laughs> but uh, yeah, they found me on Google, man. I asked him, he said he found me on Google search. And like I said, I'm 45 minutes. I'm actually more than 45 minutes away. I'm about, just, yeah, I mean, I'm about 45. It's almost an hour away, man. And that's how he found me. That's crazy. So I guess I'm ranking pretty well. That SEO, that SEO working real good, man. All right, guys, man. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Um, make sure you like. You know I'm saying leave a comment. If you're new to the channel, man, you know I'm saying go ahead and subscribe. And uh, show your support, man. Y'all stay tuned, man. Enjoy the video, like I said. I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace.